the price and weightage for three material PQR in the year 2018 based on 2016. Given the composite index of P and Q in 2018 based on 2016 is 120, whereas the composite index for material P and R is 1 to 5, determine the ratio X, Y, Z. So you see here, first, composite index of P and Q. P and Q. So composite index means sum of index, individual index times their weightage, Divide by sum of weightage. For P and Q, the individual index. So P, we have the index of 80. The weight is X plus Q. The index is 130 times Y divide. So sum of uh, sum of weightage is P and Q is X plus Y. So here for P and R, so it's given that the composite index is equal to sum of individual index times their weightage divided by sum of weightage. So index for P is 80. X, so P and X plus. So for R, we have 140 times Z. And the weightage is sum of weightage is P and R. P is X plus Z. This one is equal to 1, 2, 5. So here, when we multiply, we get 120x plus 120y is equal to 80x plus 130y. So if we group x and y together, if we bring to this side, so we get 120x minus 80 is 40x is equal to, so this one is 130y minus 120y, we get 10y. So we get 4x is equal to y. So x over y, we will get x divided by y and we bring 4 to this to the right side we get 1 over 4 so we see here ratio of x to y is equal to ratio 1 4 and for this one if we multiply 1 to 5 x plus 1 to 5 z is equal to 80 x plus 140 z so again we group together we bring x to this side so 125 x minus 80 is 45 x is equal to 140 minus 1 to 5 z so we get 15 z yeah. so divided by 15 this one we get 3x is equal to z so you see here x over z is equal to so we bring z here and we bring 3 to the right so we get 1 over 3 so we know that the ratio x to z is equal to 1 to 3 so you see here we place together, we have x, y. So here x, y, z is equal to. So x and y, we have 1 and 4. And then for x and z, we have 1 and 3. x and z, we have 1 and 3. So you see, since this one is 1, so this one is 1, 4, 3. So this is the ratio of x, y, z. 1, 4, 3.